What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel, it's JK Flash and today we're going to talk about this. Brother, right in the middle of filming, I'm going to put this in, this is Luke. Just call me when I'm filming my YouTube videos, bruv. <laughs> let me let you into a little secret. I shot all that on this. So, we're in the studio. I've set up a little, I've got a bit of a crazy rig bit going on here. <laughs> Use the magic card to get some crazy angles. But, I'm using Filmic. Pro app and basically shooting in their it's like their flat log which is if I show you here it is basically their log v2 so it's just flat color profile and obviously with the filmic pro app you can control uh, everything from exposure to your focus it's got focus peaking you can zoom so like a storm's going on outside. As you can see, it's getting some nice clean spinning shots on my little cheap 10, 10 pounds. This was, this literally was 10 pounds, this table. This spinner table here, this was a 10 pound table. Use a bit of sellotape to hold the phone up. Everything's budget, as you know. Nice. Close up, there we go. Yes, exactly what I needed. So, yeah, so I'm currently just booming the arm of the LED light over the top. So I've got nice constant lighting. And that's it, guys. It's nothing too tough, really. It's just to show you guys that anyone can make these kind of videos. But yeah, this Filmic app is crazy. I'm going to go into more detail about this, but it is incredible. So you have like your zebras, You've got false color, go down to settings, you can change your resolution. So I'm shooting at uh, two, uh, sorry, 4K, everything, RGB colors, a lot. It's cool, absolutely incredible. So guys, now I'm just getting a nice detailed shot of the back of the watch, as you can see, nice. That's it, simple as that, nothing too tough. All detail shots. Simple. Thinking about maybe putting some like ticking sounds in the sound effects. And we just sit inside this box, just ticking away. All I used was a like, top down light, spinning table, and LED light. Just to get one of those shots. And that is it. Simple as that. Just use it again at one of my sound balls just to just stop the light from bleeding out. Other than that. That is it. And I just add my iPad there just for background YouTubes. <laughs> I've got my P40 Pro here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump into the Filmic Pro app. We're gonna jump into the app and then we're gonna check out some features. Okay guys, so we're in the app. So as you can see here, over at this column here, this is where I tapped V vlog so it's log v2 and then obviously you've got your different colors that you can change it to and you just tap the screen to get out and then over here this is where you can have all your this is like your shutter iso this is your shutter speed this is your iso then over here you have your focusing and your zoom and then your record button stop and then your playback with all the clips and as you can see there's all my clips I shot on my phone to make that edit oh let me jump into this as well so when you go to settings I went to resolutions and I went on 4k and filmic extreme so that's like the highest quality you can shoot square 16 by 9 4 by 3 all different formats there you go you can select your frame rate you can do all your different frame rates here 
So you can just select. That's it basically. That's just a little quick look at the app. As you can see, look, you've got uh, your audio coming into the phone. So as you can see, it was shot on my phone. It's nothing too, too tough at all. So we're gonna jump into the computer and I'm gonna go over my quick little timeline. It's just a really simple cuts. See you on the computer. <laughs> So guys, we jumped into the edit. So all you can see is a basic timeline. So I've got my title here, which is the fade. On the drop. So I've got my title here. That's my intro. <laughs> so I've got my title here. Then it drops on the beat straight into the watch. Cut to the box, cut close up. Another close up on the inside of the watch. Wide top down, spin. This is actually just a app. I've literally just flipped the shot upside down. I just noticed that there's a little, oh geez, a little cut there. It's not fully stretched. So lucky I did do this, eh? So it needs to be stretched all the way, like so. See? It's all just easy cut to the beat, straight to the beat. To the beat. And a little fade. And back in. That is it. Simple as that. And then all I've done was just add an easy little colour grade to it. Literally just added some saturation to the flat. That is it. Just drop some blacks down, lift some whites, and that is basically the edit. Nothing too tough at all. Just synced it to the beat of the music, and that is it. There you go, guys. Simple as that. Just want to say so. As you can see, you can shoot and make any sort of content using just your phone or a cheap camera or expensive camera. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and please share, please like, please comment, hit the bell, bangers, whistles, bosh, whatnot, hit everything and stay tuned. I'll see you guys on Sunday. I'm JK Flash. I'm out of here. See you later.